After two years and 35,000 miles on the road together, we returned home to one burning question. How did we not kill each other? We've got a few secrets, and today we want to share one. Improv. We took an improv class before our trip because improv's all about one thing, supporting your teammates with the philosophy, yes and. Whenever one of your teammates says something, you agree with it and you keep going. Look, Alex, over there, it's a crocodile. I don't see a crocodile. And you see that, the scene's dead. And that's why we do yes and. Alex, look, it's a crocodile. Crikey, what are we doing in this lake with crocodiles? And now we have a scene that works. When you spend every day together, an atmosphere of total support for each other makes things work. And this goes far beyond just playing improv. If you can yes and each other all the time, everybody stays in good spirits. You don't need anything to do improv, and you don't need to be an expert. We often just invented our own little games. Buckle up, it's gonna get bumpy. Well, yeah, and if we end up in water, you just gotta blow on those two little taps. Yeah. will be safe. Why don't you go ahead and do the whole demonstration? Uh-huh. You take it out, and you put it in. Wait a second. If you're doing the demonstration, who's driving the car? There's a lot of reasons to want to kill your friends when you're traveling, but busting out a simple improv game a few minutes a day, make sure you don't. Share this video with somebody you spend way too much time with. I'm Eric. I'm Brian. I'm Alex. There's a crocodile! <gasps> Brilliant!